Sunday to every one of you. Happy Sunday. This is Fina Talk live and direct coming to you again. Wow, wow. What a beautiful day. And today's topic is an amazing one. Beautiful. You know, always, I always have amazing topic, beautiful topic that we'll talk about on Fina Talk. So today is another amazing topic and you will like it. So invite your friends, tell everyone that Fina Talk is here again. And today I have with me amazing guests. Wow, Gloria, I'm so excited. I'm so excited. They have amazing guests with me today to discuss today's topic, to talk about it. And Fina Talk is all about you know, um, relating every topic with the Word of God. That's what we do. We relate every topic with the Word of God. And we want to know what the Word of God has said concerning that thing. Maybe concerning the challenging you are going through, concerning any situation at all. We always relate it with the Word of God. What does the Word of God say? So that's what we are here to talk about today. So join me to welcome amazing Sister Chidi Ma Glory. What an honor to be here on Fina Talk with me today. I'm so glad. And I'm so glad that you're here. <laughs> I'm super excited. Thank you for having me. Amen. I'm Glory sure the to today will be in for a great Yes, you are in for a great time. Do you hear that? You you are in for a great time today. Wonderful, amazing. So without wasting much time or taking much of our time, today's topic is God liquid love. Wow, glory! Hot liquid love. It's an amazing topic that many people are wondering how is God is liquid love. What is God's liquid love? What is love? You know, many people know about the general love, but they don't know God's liquid love, God's amazing love. So that is what we are here today to talk about. And Sister Chidima will be. You know, throwing more life to it, God's liquid love, and what is God's liquid love? Praise the Lord. And just that you might, what do you have to say to our viewer? Yes, first of all, thank you so much again for having me. Thank over. you. Um, I'm really excited to be here, and even more excited about God. Wow, <laughs> <laughs> yes, yeah, so wow, that is so beautiful. It's double. Yes, yeah, so yeah, talk of love generally. Mm -hmm. You know, God's liquid love for me is. Okay. And it's um, um, 
Ephesians, Ephesians chapter 3, verse mm -hmm. 18. Okay. Wow. If you are pleased, if you have your Bible, you follow us up. Yes, but well, even if you can just note it down and you can go back to yeah. get it for yourself. You yes. Know, this is what um, gives you the confidence mm -hmm. to rely upon that. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. So, so take your Bible, as we say, that as you are watching, we are sharing God's word and also we are relating it to the word of God. So get your Bible as you are watching. You'll be following us and see what we are talking about. Okay, so I will. Says Ephesians 3 18 says, mm -hmm. Then you'll be empowered mm -hmm. to discover what every holy one experiences mm -hmm. the great magnitude of the astonishing love of Christ wow. in all its dimensions, mm -hmm. how deeply intimate wow. and far reaching is his love, mm -hmm. how enduring and inclusive it is. Mm -hmm. Endless love, oh, mm -hmm. beyond measurement, wow. that transcends our understanding. Wow, that's amazing. This extravagant love mm -hmm. pours into you wow. until you are filled to overflowing with the fullness of God. God. Wow. This is the what a translation. I love this yes. translation. This is the it, passion it, translation. It, it, it breaks, breaks it down. Yeah. It breaks it down. Like So that's why, why I said God's living love has to do it's a metaphoric way mm -hmm. of expressing what we're trying to communicate to yes. you. That's wow. why I say, you, say you are filled to the overflow. Mm. When you are filled with the love of God, it just pours out from you. Mm. Amazing. So even if, you know, some people say, ah, he, I, I reacted that way because he pushed me to the wall. Mm -hmm. When you are filled with the word of God, there's no limit. There's no limit. There's no limit. <laughs> and even if someone no steps on your nerves, so yeah. all that comes out is love. Wow. You know, like that scripture that talked about uh, John 3 16. I love that. That was one of my favorite, you know, scripture that I was always, you know, reading to talk about how God loved the world so much. How God loved the world. Wow. Let, let's take it. Yes. Okay. So it says, For God to love the world, that He gave His only begotten Son. Wow. That whosoever, anybody, doesn't matter um, your background, your personality. Everyone, everyone with the exception of no one, mm -hmm. whosoever mm -hmm. believes on him mm -hmm. shall not, not perish, perish but have everlasting, everlasting life. Glory to God. Yeah. Glory to God. Have everlasting life. He didn't say if you qualify. He didn't say when your background is well arranged. He didn't say you are about your education. Anybody, whosoever, for God so loved the world, even in the world of sinners, of course. even like today, people that are not born again, mm -hmm. God loved the gospel of sin. Wow. And I think verse 17 says something. Yes. Yeah. It says, God loved
dancing. He came in a human form to help us get what the plan he has for us. Do you understand? But now God has said, I don't want to force man anymore. I want man to have his own will. Yes. Man is actually. Because when when God created um, Adam and Eve, He told them, Don't touch this. Don't do this. Do you understand? Yes. And man think that why is God telling me not to do this? Means that there's something inside. Yes. And if they listen to the wrong voice and something happened, God, well, that's okay. I don't want to make choice for you anymore. I want you to take your decision. So now God has lived the word for us to manage. He said, he said, I've given the word to the children of men. So what did God say we should do? He said, I've said before you, life and content. He said, as for me, I created the evil and the good. But I'm advising you, choose the life so that you will Okay, so people decided to choose evil. They decided to choose bad. And they are still blaming God. But God has already said to you, I said before you, life and death. So why can't you choose good and evil? You know, it's normal for the human nature. I don't know if you subconsciously. You know, it's just like someone, someone who wears a shoe, mm -hmm. goes out, probably did not take care to wash yeah. his head. Yeah. And hit his leg. And then he's. you. The love of God is not about you. It's not about what you have done or 
who your kind of personality or who you are or your background is just his love for you and the bible says for god so loved the world that he gave means that love is, is given yeah this particular scripture i read mm -hmm. is you know come to that statement yeah, yeah. it's very important mm -hmm. but what one thing i love about this because we actually mm -hmm. because it says i love each of you with the same love that the father loves you wow. because there's some people who feel that you know, god loves this other person more than, more than he loves me. you okay, mm -hmm. i'm showing sure, i don't think you can love do, do, do you know, sorry, do you know, so in my working place, some of my colleagues will be asking that God, why, why is God so passionate? That God decide to make some people um, live very largely and give them a lot of wealth and some so other people are so suffering. I'm not told them, the ones that are suffering is because they lack knowledge. Yes, yeah, they, they lack knowledge. And he, what did he say? He said he has paid the price and he has given us all things that pertain to life and godliness. So everything you need in life has already prearranged for us. So what do you want to do? Uh, how, what are we supposed to do is to cue in and accept that, that love into our life and work on it. So, you see, God does not want to bless A and leave B. The love that God has for us is called love. He does not love you lesser than I. Love me like the way you love The only difference is in you choosing to accept that love. The extent of the love. As you said, that love is a choice. You accepting God's love also is a choice. It's a choice because, I mean, every day, when you go out in life, as long as you live in this mm -hmm. life, mm -hmm. the Bible describes the heart of man. Mm -hmm. And when we say the heart of man, we talk about the heart of the unregenerated mm -hmm. man, the mm -hmm. one who is not born again. Yeah. The Bible says it's desperately wicked. Mm -hmm. That's, That's what it says. That the heart of man is desperately wicked. wicked. So man in his default state has wicked thoughts. Wow. Wicked intentions. That's why as a natural reflex, someone mm -hmm. steps at you. Mm -hmm. Your natural reason is to shout so, so so you don't, don't, don't you see me? What, what is wrong with you? I will react by getting yeah. physical. Yeah, was the that is the default state of a man who is not born again. Wow. Now what happens is that when you get when you accept Christ's mm -hmm. love and into you your life, yeah. into your life, that love it brings you the everything. Peace. There's you something new. there's something my pastor said today. That was amazing. There was something my pastor said today about Love. There's something he said. He said, he said God's love. He said, it's a God's love. He said God's love has power to change man. He said God's love. He said it has transforming power to change life. He can change your character, that your attitude will be. God's love has the power there. To change, to change life. That's if you allow it. Yes. And in life, we don't just say mm -hmm. about it having its power to transform life. Mm -hmm. I'll quickly just make reference to the scripture mm -hmm. in First John four twenty one. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. It says, "For God has given us this command: mm -hmm. Whoever loves God yeah. must demonstrate love to others." Wow. You need a conscious thing. Mm -hmm. You, if you love God. You Demonstrate love to others. Mm. Love is not selfish. You know, before we yeah. go, I, 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 I put it here. Yes. Love, God's love is selfless. And it's without condition. It's an unconditional love. Yeah. yeah. You know, but, but you see the love we have today. There's condition. What is called love? That, that is the word love. Yes, it true. has condition attached to it. When you do this thing, do this I, thing. I love you. I, I love you. Yes. When you miss it, miss one mark. When you look like this, you have <laughs> flat stone. <laughs> <laughs> the love is out. <laughs> but when you come back and do this thing, I love you. I love you. When you buy oh gifts, I love you. You know, it's, it's, it's amazing. Th that, that's the kind of love the world has. But for me, I would like to say something that, um, Pastor Chris, mm. my life yeah, um, we always say you cannot give what you don't have. Yeah. Wow, this is beautiful. You cannot 
give what you don't have. Yes, you can give. Wow. So yes, the people of the world call mm-hmm. what they feel because mm-hmm. it's all about emotions, mm-hmm. feelings for them, mm-hmm. and they sum it up as love. Well. Mm-hmm. But the knowledge truth is that mm-hmm. God is love, mm-hmm. and the one who does not have God is love. Wow, I think I think that John, you you read it that John, God, God is love. love. Yeah, mm. God is love. So and even with that, John, he said, "What he said, you can't love your brother when who oh, you, 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 you have not seen, and you say you love God. Mm-hmm. That that's you cannot love God who you don't see and hate and, your, and brother. Hate your brother. Yes, yeah, you, you you cannot hate your brother that you are seeing, mm-hmm. and you say you love, love God. God. Yeah. This is not possible. Yeah, that's why that scripture says, whoever loves God." Must demonstrate that love, love to, to others. others. Yes, mm. you know I. I love what you just said last now. That you can't give what you, you can't give what you don't have. Yes. You Please, are give. you watching? Are you watching? Are you hearing what you are saying? You cannot give what you don't have. This is very very important. You know, many people think that they can get what they don't have, or they can give what they don't have. It's not possible. It's only what you have that you. Yeah. <laughs> love is not boastful, it's not selfish, 
you go. Okay, so we can read it. But I think you can read because I'm not get I'm not getting my own here. Okay, oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. of love. Yeah. <laughs> so it's from first Corinthians thirteen, just mm -hmm. in case you want to join me. Yeah. Um from verse um, four. It's called okay. charity here in King James, but um okay. it's also love. Mm -hmm. So it says charity suffereth long yes. and is kind. Uh, you are reading it from King James. Okay. I'll okay. read that. Yeah, like you are reading from Corinthians first Corinthians thirteen verse four. From four. From okay. Four, yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Four to eight is okay. really um, it's the real main yes, thing. It yeah. you about love. Mm -hmm. Charity suffering long mm -hmm. and is kind. Mm -hmm. So here King James uses charity, mm -hmm. but charity is also love. Yeah. So yeah. I'll just replace it with love. Okay. It says love suffering long. Mm -hmm. Love is kind. Kind. Yeah. Love envieth not. Yeah. Love vanteth not mm -hmm. itself. Mm -hmm. Love is not puffed up. Wow. Love Are you reading from your? Yes, from no from, from King, King James. James. Okay. I will read from that. When I read from that yeah, one, it like, like it's that really one. <laughs> it's a love does not behave itself mm -hmm. unseemly. Mm -hmm. It does not it seeketh not her own. Mm -hmm. It's not easily provoked. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Love is not easily provoked. Oh, it wow. seeketh no evil. Mm -hmm. Love rejoiceth not in it, in it iniquity, it, but rejoiceth in the truth. truth love beareth all things. All things. You know, you can't say, I can't take it, I can't take it. I can't it. take it. He bears. No, no, no. He bears all things. But somebody will say, Are you asking me to bear because yeah. of so <laughs> No, but that's what Somebody is saying, saying that. <laughs> Are you asking me to bear these things until mm -hmm. I'm not able to bear it anymore? Uh, you, you know, it's crazy. You know, it's really crazy. No, that that that, that one. If you're in mm -hmm. an abusive relationship and you say you're enduring it because of love, that's oh, not what we're talking about here. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What we are referring to here, bearing all things, means mm -hmm. um, like there's a scripture that explains it that mm -hmm. say he that's in Christ takes mm -hmm. no offense. Yeah. That no one can offend you. Yeah. You can't come to the point where you forget that you are full of God's love. Yeah. And the only response you can give the people mm -hmm. is love. Yeah. Yeah, it's love. So love believes all things, it hopes all things, mm -hmm. it endures all things. Mm -hmm. Love never fails. Fails. But ah, when the, yeah. Love never fails. Wow. So, amazing. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I'll quickly just read those Reads, yeah. mm -hmm. those verses from the Passion Translation. Passion, yeah. I love it. Okay. So beautiful. It says love is large. Wow. And incredibly patient. Mm -hmm. Ah. You know, some people are not patient and they will tell you that's yes. just her. I'm not a patient. I'm, I'm not a patient. Hey, don't tell me to be patient. Too. My patience is slim. <laughs> like, mm, I don't have time for nonsense. Don't tell me to be patient because mm. I cannot be patient yes. at all. Like, oh, uh, I just like when people mm. are young around me, they should behave themselves. Everybody should sit up. <laughs> I, I don't have time for nonsense. Oh my God. It says love is large. It's and large. Incredibly mm -hmm. patient. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Love is gentle. Wow. When you see, that's why when you see someone filled with the love of mm -hmm. God who expresses it and gives thanks to God's mm -hmm. love, they are usually calm and gentle. They are calm and gentle. Wow. They, they don't have those responses. Uh, 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 how, of, how, how can we come to that state? You know, when when this love of God fills your heart mm -hmm. and you are calm and gentle, mm -hmm. how, how can we achieve it? How does we achieve such love? Such God's love that that. Melt everything around you. So you know when you receive the love of God mm -hmm. you, like when you get born again, mm -hmm. your spirit gets recreated, mm -hmm. and the love of God fills your heart. Yes. Now there's a Mm. Part for you to play, to play. Mm. and that part is you expressing mm -hmm. that love mm -hmm. out. Mm -hmm. So, and like I said, it's a choice, so it's something you do consciously. consciously. Tell me because you know, as you renew your mind mm -hmm. daily with, mm -hmm. the, word with God, the word of God, you train your spirit, you discover that those sharp, mm -hmm. aggressive responses are removed from you. Yes, they are removed, so okay. you, you do not begin to. Allow the love of God come out mm -hmm. through you. Mm -hmm. Places where you know you you begin to have what I call mm -hmm. um, large room. Wow. To accommodate everyone's Everybody. excesses. Yes. 
oh she's like that mm -hmm. you, with love you overcome everything you overcome everything you overcome wow. you can you love, love 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 can love. make a very difficult person mm. become so easy to work with wow yes mm. That if the yes. person allowed the love of God to, to flow, to flow, and the Bible says that the love of God shall abroad in our hearts. hearts. Yes, it's it's just a choice. It's for mm. example, if you know that um, mm -hmm. someone does, for example, mm -hmm. I you know when I was in college, mm -hmm. there was an incident, and mm -hmm. someone came to meet me because I smile a lot. They don't, mm -hmm. you know, they even give me a smile. <laughs> Smiley girl. Yes. So one. Um, of my colleagues that mm -hmm. walked up to me, she said she's been thinking about it, it's been on her mind. I was mm -hmm. like, What? She said, Do you ever get angry? <laughs> I said, To be honest with you, if I say no now, you may go home thinking yeah. that was how I used to be. Yeah, I used to know. I said, And I told her that that was not how I used to be. Mm -hmm. When I got born again, I just realized there was this peace mm -hmm. that the love of God brought in me. Wow. And each time, maybe there were situations that would demand. A reaction sure. or a, re a response mm -hmm. that is contrary to my nature. Mm -hmm. I just, I my don't give in. Yes, I just walk away. Wow. I walk away. I don't see like ah no, I'm too big. No, ah mm -hmm. no, no, no. I'm, mm -hmm. I just why walk would away. Pay, why would she talk to me like because that? Because the truth about love is that it says love is not selfish. People mm -hmm. think that word what it means. Another way I I define love is mm -hmm. not selfish. It means love is not self thinking. Mm. It means if I'm considering you, and I know if I tell you this thing, mm -hmm. you're going to be hurt. I won't say it. Wow. It's as simple as that. That is beautiful. Someone hits my car from mm -hmm. behind, mm -hmm. and I know that once I come out shouting, maybe mm -hmm. the guy has had a bad, bad day, and I don't know. It's not everybody that thinks like that. Yeah, this. because that, that, it's selfish. The people don't understand when you say love is not selfish. It means, it means love is not self-seeking. Like what you are saying, only you. what you are saying means that. We are God-like. We are, we are. He, we have His love in us. It means that we are like God. Yes, we have the because ability. Because if you to behave that like exactly. this, because this is what the love of God contains. Yes, this is what He carries. Yes. So it means that if you are acting like this, mm -hmm. you are demonstrating God. God, exactly. Wow. This is. It's awesome. That's why you said, are demonstrating God by your action as yes. a Christian. Yes. I know because me. that's why the Bible says this is love. Mm -hmm. This is God's love. Mm -hmm. it means that this is who you are. Mm -hmm. It's your person. It's your person. Yes, there's no other way to describe you. It's yeah. your person. I mean, I feel like just like jumping. <laughs> you know, you it's should... your person. Yes, I'm getting blessed. Mm -hmm. Even you... though, even though I'm, I'm hosting <laughs> this program. I'm, I'm, I'm learning, I'm getting some aspiring, you know, yes. things. I'm getting blessed. Wow. It's your person. Mm -hmm. You train your spirit to the point that mm. there is nobody person. you meet that you can't love. You lose. can't love. My mother God always said that, Pastor Chris. He yes. says there's nobody that he has met that he has never loved. And no good, unconditional love. Liquid love, liquid love that does not own it. Define it again. You defined it at yes. the beginning. No, no, some viewers that are just coming, they're just watching us now, so they didn't hear when you defined it. Yes, so I said it's a love that is without um, boundaries. Yes, it without flows, boundaries. It's endless, mm -hmm. it overflows. Mm -hmm. it's, it has no regard for your background, mm -hmm. who you are, who you your are, experiences, yeah. your mistakes. Mm -hmm. It's a love that flows that and just flows flow. without nothing holding it. Yes, that's what we call. Liquid love without nothing holding the love. And unconditional, unconditional love. love. Love without conditions. Wow. He doesn't say, Oh, unless you do this. Oh God. He loves you just the way you are. Mm. That's the exciting thing. Exciting. I'll just quickly be finish mm. this uh quote yeah. from this translation okay. before we move on. Mm. So he says love is gentle mm -hmm. and consistently kind to all. Mm -hmm. It refuses to be jealous when blessing comes to someone wow. else. Mm -hmm. Love does not mm. brag about when blessing comes to someone else. else. Yes. It refuses to be jealous. Mm. So why that's why I said when you read four to eight from this translation, it breaks it down to see that Oh, when so blessing comes to someone else, does not jealous. Yes. 
there are some people that uh, you know you tell them they like, mm -hmm. and in their mind it's like God, what will you do now? Do, uh, uh, yes, like, not even down with saying, eh, does she deserve it? Yeah, exactly. Did it deserve so so much like is that? Is she better than me? Is it better than even sometimes they will even query God? Mm -hmm. God, why are you blessing Mr. Be like that? Mm -hmm. I, I, I've been serving you for years now. Yes. I, 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 what is he doing that I'm not, not doing? Exactly. I'm just a, miss, you are jealous. God, God is just saying, this thing you are just saying now. That's the reason why you are not yes, the yes. blessing. There's no love in your because heart. there's no love in your heart. You could have said, Thank you, Father, for blessing Mr. B. Thank you, Lord, for blessing Sister A. That is amazing. Thank you so much for the blessing. Oh, I received my, I received my. You see? Are you rejoice with Mr. A? And it's in an atmosphere of love, you can oh. have miracles, mm. you can have testimonies. Yes, where there's hatred, That's... where there's strife. There you is no, have the you can't God's have God's miracle God. in the midst of strife and hatred. You can't have miracle, mm -hmm. but in the atmosphere of joy, of love, there is miracle, yes. there is blessing that we are born yes. in abundance. Mm -hmm. Just give your heart to rejoicing. Mm -hmm. Yes, the scripture it, love does not brag about one's achievements nor inflate his own importance. Mm. You don't think, oh, I'm, I'm important I'm that this person... If I'm not the one that did it, then it was not done well. You know, mm. some people have that attitude. They have over half. Yeah, like, if they are not the one that do a particular thing, they just feel... You get what I just said, say over half. half. <laughs> the person did not do it well. <laughs> it's amazing, oh eh? But it exists. Yes. yes! The person did not do it yes, well. Yes, as long as it's not them that did it. Ah, they didn't Jesus. Nobody can read it better than I. That, than I, yes, yes. But yes. well, it's a love doesn't do that. It doesn't do that. Mm. This is beautiful. A love does not traffic in shame and disrespect. Mm. Nor selfishly seek his own honor. People that plot. Mm. Ah, I have me at, at my age. Yes. I've been seven years in this company. Mm. I'm supposed to be a manager. Yes, when but now coming, just because yes. you have masters, no, yes. then you start plotting. Plotting, plotting. everywhere. To, to plan against mm -hmm. that person. So, so that you and, and you know there are some blocking people. people's progress. There are people like that. And you know there are some people that, and for example, this other another way I look at this that he says love does not selfishly seek his own honor. Mm -hmm. You know there are some people that, for example, mm -hmm. you want to give a speech or something, mm -hmm. and you just ask for their input. Mm -hmm. Maybe they help you write on two paragraphs, mm -hmm. and you go to read it. They'll mm -hmm. start telling everybody, I'm, I okay. help her. <laughs> yes, if not for me, I help her. I, I'm the one that helps yes, her to, help to achieve her. it. I'm the one that look you know, to achieve that that mm -hmm. progress. Look at the way she she's not even greeting me anymore. Mm -hmm. They are like that. They want everybody to know uh, yeah. uh, you should honor me like I yeah, honor yeah. because I did that. Yeah, I did it for her, but mm -hmm. she's not even greeting me anymore. Sir. But that's me. Wow. So you mean love should overlook all that. Even though you help somebody to achieve something. Mm -hmm. Even though you, you, you were involved in the person's success and progress. Mm -hmm. And the person yes. did not even recognize it. You. It doesn't matter. You say it doesn't matter. Love overlooks all of that. This is beautiful. It's, it's amazing, you know. It says, love is not easily irritated. I just love that one. Or oh, quick to take offense. Like, ah, quick to take offense. Yeah, I know. That's why I say this part, <laughs> I like it. This that, is, what it is. Is this still love? It's, no, you it just have the yeah. few lines. Wow. But, you know, there are some people that say, ah, she didn't spell my name with capital letter. <laughs> what? Ah, ah, she called this one, my dad. Oh, she my God. Makes them jump. This is so beautiful. And they pick offense everywhere. So I love that translation. That translation is beautiful. You should get it. The passion translation. Passion translation. Yes. Then we are reading First Corinthians chapter 13, 13, 4 to 8. 4 to 8 from, the passion translation. from the passion translation. So at least you should get this. At least with this one, you are reading it for yourself every day. Yes. It's reminding you of what, of is, what in you. is in you. Yes. The liquid love of God, we are we supposed to demonstrate it because yes. we are God kind. Yes. We are God like. Mm -hmm. Wow. So I finish it off. It says love joyfully celebrates honesty. 
Mm. He finds no delight in what is wrong. Mm -hmm. Love is a safe place of shelter. A safe place of shelter. shelter. Yes. It mm. never stops believing the best for others. Mm. Love never takes failure as defeat. For oh my never God. gives up. Wow. Love never stops loving. Love never stop loving. Even though you are you are un unlovable. Yes. Even when you're not sorry, but yes. not sorry, they, are they, they, they are unlovable. unlovable. Mm -hmm. They are not they are not loving at all. Even though you are unlovable, say love, love never stops loving. I think we will have sec we will have another, we part, another two. part. Yes. We will have part two <laughs> of this God's liquid love. Wow. Glory to God. Because of our time. I think we will stop okay. here. Yes. Once the Chidima. It's been amazing. I told you so much. <laughs> Have you? Do you hear that? This was so much. You know. You know, like I, I'm just bubbling inside. You know, yes. there's still a lot to come out. There are a lot of things. Yes. Wow! Look at all the points. Love never stops mm -hmm. loving. We will take part two of this episode. God's liquid love. We will take part two again, and we'll come with. Sister Chidima, she has more for us. She has more for us. Thank you so much, Sister Chidima. It's been an amazing time. Thank you Definitely so much for pouring time. that art out, for pouring your art out to our viewers, and also for me that I'm sitting here with you. And be blessed by this. This is amazing. I'm so blessed. I'm going to get that, uh, that translation. Great. I'm, I'm going to get it. I'm going to get it. Wow. Thank you so much, viewer. Thank you so much for sharing the video and also for watching us, listening to this amazing liquid love of God. So you heard what we have shared here today. In case you are watching us and you are not born again, this is the time for you to experience God kind of love. You need to accept Jesus into your life. You need to accept him. You need to allow him to be the Lord and Savior of your life. And your life will change. The love we, we thought maybe is love, that's the word love. It's not love until you come to the love of Christ. Then you will see liquid love of God. It does not hold anything at all against anybody. He said you rejoice always. Love rejoice always. You rejoice about your progress, your success. So it's an amazing one. Thank you so much for watching. So in case you are watching us, you have not given your life to Christ. I would like Sister Chidima to lead our viewers to Christ right now. Most of you that are watching us, you have not given your life to Christ. You want to give your heart to the Lord. Please, you repeat all those words after Sister Chidima. Thank you very much for this panel. I want to encourage you in making the prayer with me today that you are making the most important decision of your life. Mm -hmm. I would like you to say this word after me, meaning it with your whole heart. Yes. And be ready for that transformation. Amen. So, and just for the consciousness of what you do, you can place your hand, your hands over your chest Amen. and say this word after me. Say, Dear God in heaven, mm -hmm. I thank you. Mm -hmm. I come to you today. Yes. I accept Jesus as Lord and Savior of my life. Yes. I believe that Jesus Christ died and was raised from the dead for my justification. Amen. Yes. I confess with my mouth that Jesus is Lord over my life. Yes. I declare that I'm born again. Yes. I'm now a child of God. Amen. I belong to the family of God. Yes. I receive salvation for my soul yes. now. Yes. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Thank you, Father. Thank you. Thank you for accepting me. Yes. Thank you for loving me. Yes. I, today I declare I'm born again. Amen. Yes. In Jesus' name. Wow. Lord. Amen. And I'd just like to pray for you. Yes. Father, in the name of the Lord Jesus. We thank you for as many that have said that prayer. Amen. Lord, we thank you because they will experience the love of Christ Amen. that knows no bounds. Amen. The boundless love of Christ. Amen. That such peace will come into their hearts. Amen. And Lord, we thank you because from today, they will walk in the consciousness of the newness of life they receive now. Hallelujah. And the love of God will be made manifest Amen. to them in everything that they do. Amen. If there be anyone hurting, Depressed, broken. Mm. Lord, your love is meeting that one and the man. Even now, 
homes are restored. I see Amen. families being restored. Oh, glory to oh because God. yes, their hearts are oh, open to the Lord of Christ. In the name of the Lord Jesus. Thank you for your love that brings healing yes. to this to the disheartened, to the broken hearted. Lord, Hallelujah. we thank you because thank many you, minds are restored. Yes. Many hopes are brought alive Amen. again because of your love and all that Christ has done yes. for us. Yes. In the name of the Lord Amen. Jesus. Amen. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' name. Amen. Wow. wow. Congratulations to you. If you just saw those simple word of salvation, congratulations to you. You are now born again. Welcome to the family of God. That's an amazing one. Wow. Thank you so much, Sister Jennifer. I'm so happy having you here. I, I was so blessed by what you shared with us about God's living love. Thank you so much, Via. So please share this video until I come your way next time. And, uh, you know, for this program, Fina Talk, it's always every Sunday. So please join me on Facebook, 5 p.m. every Sunday. And also on YouTube, it's free not talk. So join me as we share the word of God together. Thank you so much. I come your way. Me and the children will be telling you. Bye-bye.